Uh, so this is uh, Audi R8 V10 Gen 1 air filter setup. So this fits manual or Artronic. Uh, basically the Gen 1 V10s with a single air box. So we have got uh, intake tubes. So these are by our friends at Ram Air. Uh, so we've got intake tubes that take the air mass meters. Uh, and they obviously sit in the throttle pipes and then sit in the air box. So they do have an orientation because they're flat, sort of got a flat edge at the top. Air mass meter sits in the side. Uh, the intake tube goes on the goes on the front and it's even got the factory uh, recess uh, to locate the tube properly. And then we have got Ram Air's foam filter. So we back to back these with brand new filters on our dyno. So I had an R8 V10 tuned on brand new filters, ran it on a dyno, uh, put these on, and I think we gained, was it 17 horsepower? Um, I will, we'll put the dyno charts on the video, I'll get the dyno charts to put on my video. So it's a dry, dry foam filter. It's not oiled, we don't use oil filters because the air mass meter uses a hot film. Uh, if you use an oiled filter, like your old motocross bike, uh, you would destroy your air mass meters. So this is a dry foam filter, completely washable. Um, wire mesh reinforced, but I don't know whether you can catch it, Davey. But we've also, I nagged at them until they did me a bell mouth on the inside. So it is a proper, the base plate is a proper bell mouth. So it's not a square plate with a hole in it to let the air through. It's a proper curved bell mouth. And then there's a recess then on the inside to take the tube as well. So after it's after it's come through the bell mouth and the air's transitioned through the bell mouth, it's then got a straight run into the throttle tube. So a pair of those in a nice fancy box. Um, yeah, we've been working on it a little while. We're now working on the Gen 2, the Gen 1 facelift and the Gen 2 air boxes and we're working on the V8s. The V8's gonna be much easier because you haven't got to change the air mass tubes. Um, so we'll just get similar filters to go on stock tubes. Uh, and then we'll work on the Gen, we'll work on the Gen 2 filters as well. Um, it was just something people were asking. Uh, there's a couple of manufacturers out there doing them and they're oiled and you do a couple of thousand miles on the car to run like a bag uh, because the air mass meters were ruined. Or then you've got, uh, there was another company doing them and they were like 600 quid um, and they, they, they just weren't worth the money. So we thought we do a Ram Air a lot. They do all the induction kits on our twin turbo stuff. So I spoke to Dan and he hooked us up. Good stuff. So are these available now from our informants? Yep, they're exclusive to us. So they are branded Ram Air, um, but they are, yeah, they're exclusive to us. So we have some sat on the shelf uh, we've had a load go out the door already to our to some of our existing clients and to some of the guys on the forums. But yeah, drop us a message and we'll get you set in a post. Cool. And we'll we'll put the links at the end of the, uh, the video as well, so people can yeah click through to yeah. uh, just purchase. And what what do they retail for it? Uh, so they are two hundred and fifty pound plus VAT delivered. So what's that? Three hundred quid delivered to your door anywhere in the UK. And, and that is uh, what you see here: two intake tubes, two air filters. So. Good stuff. Good enough. Thank you, buddy. No worries. You're very welcome. Let's give Jordan his, uh, his detailing way back. Say bye, Jordan. See you, guys.